we offer all kinds of courses on um, everything to do with bilingualism, multilingualism. We are interested as much in how children develop several languages from birth as uh, immigrant communities in London who continue to use minority languages and we would be interested in their code switching patterns or we would be interested in more teaching aspects, how do you teach foreign languages efficiently. At undergraduate level we offer courses in multilingualism and multiculturalism, sociolinguistics, so um, language in society, psycholinguistic and neurolinguistic issues, so how we process language, what happens if there's brain damage and it affects language centres of the brain. Again looking at theory and, and how we apply that um, describing those conditions but also perhaps also how we might remediate them. Topics on um, first and second language learning. At postgraduate level you can take a master's in applied linguistics but you might be able to take modules that are within the MA in language teaching as well at the same time. Uh, we have intercultural communication and again they can take topics from language teaching or applied linguistics. We cover all the areas that our students have experience and interest in because the students who come to us typically have studied languages at, at some point or have used various languages at different points of their life, have moved across continents, have rich linguistic and cultural family histories. So they all have experience that is, in fact, most interesting to us uh, teachers. As a teacher, I have found it to be very uh, uh, exciting to see a lot of positive reactions from students. And uh, after teaching uh, uh, several uh, institutes in many different countries, I, I really think that uh, this is one of the best experiences I've ever heard. And I feel I'm very lucky to be able to teach that work you know. I've really enjoyed the feedback actually, it's something that's really helped me throughout the course, um, both in terms of feedback on my assignments, which is very uh, concise and astute, but also um, in classes as well, you know, there's often group discussions, um, and I think the skills of the lecturers in sort of, you know, being able to give you the feedback that you need at the time that you need it, um, have been really useful to me. People are there for the same reason, and for the very first time in my life I could speak freely about languages and the you know all aspects of languages with my co uh, colleagues so yeah it was great we were on the same boat um, uh, aiming the same objective yeah it was good there are what we call prescriptive grammars pedagogical grammars which are evaluative in their nature we get a range of students here with a range of backgrounds so right from a range of uh, cultural and linguistic backgrounds, ethnic and national backgrounds from that perspective, but also from professional backgrounds and occupational backgrounds, even disciplines that are outside of linguistics. So we have a range of people who are simply either just interested in linguistics or may want to convert and do some more work or research in the area. They take people from various backgrounds, um, different age levels, people who believe in lifelong learning, like myself. And uh, so it's, a, it's an interesting group of students who are uh, in the main working and doing the courses part time, so they can contribute a lot of experience uh, to the class, uh, personal and, and, and work experiences. And the fact that um, we have also lots of different nationalities, so it's actually quite a creative cohort. We are very proud of the fact that we are 50 years old because uh, I think we were the first proper applied linguistics department in, in the UK. We, we organised a big conference and in fact um, we, we invited all our most esteemed colleagues. So we had former presidents of the British Association of Applied Linguistics, the president of the International Association of Applied Linguistics. In fact all our friends came and gave uh, beautiful papers and our former students were there and we hope we had future students also. We are interested in everything to do with multilingualism. All angles I think we, we have a relatively uh, nice breath and, and, and we also go very deep into the things we were interested in. So I think we, we have a very distinctive uh, identity and a unique history which is why I'm so proud to be a member of this department.
This degree was perfect for me because it allowed me to combine the study of French so I could work on um, upgrading my French skills but at the same time I was getting to learn all these fantastic things about um, how languages are structured, how they're used, how they change, how they develop and it was a sort of personal journey as well so I discovered things about myself and how I, how I relate to languages but also about how people around me are relating to languages and I think it really changed the way I see the world.